John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believe shall not perish, but have everlasting life. Amen. Believing in the son, Jesus, gets you to heaven. So let's talk about the false doctrine of love. So prevalent in many of today's uh, spiritual assemblies. And what the doctrine of love says, on the knowledge of God loves you, God loves the Muslim, God loves the Buddhist, God loves the Jew, God loves the sinner, God loves everybody. And based on that knowledge, an individual caress. God loves me. I don't need no church. But the fact is, the doctrines fail to expand on the meaning of love. And when you expand on the meaning of love according to the Bible, right, it shows you that God will not force you to accept his gift of the son. That promise of heaven. And it's that type of love. It's the love that say. I love you so much. That I will allow you to stay in your own selfish desires. So the false doctrine says God loves you. Don't worry about it. And the lost one says. That's right God loves me. I don't need to listen to nobody. God loves me. Without the knowledge of God loves you, that he will allow you to walk into hell. Sound doctrine says, God loves you because he knew you were doomed because of sin. And God loved you so much, he gave an offering. See, now we're in the spiritual dimensions. He gave the offering, the ultimate offering of his son. Because God can never embrace sin, so the Son covered the sin. Now He can embrace you. He's that type of in love with you. On the belief, He loves you. But in non belief, you love yourself. All the way to a lost case in eternity. Because you fail to believe. Be careful of that doctrine they call love. That's spiritual doctrine. It's unsound. Hmm.